Our guest author, Sheila Wagner, has written two books called All of Socks and Clay's Mustache that focus on two of the horses that have been raised at the Calkskin Creek Clydesdale Farm. And so she came and read her books to our students, K through third grade, and then our newcomers from second grade all the way up to fifth grade. So you read the words? I read the words and wrote the words. Ah, did you draw the picture? No, Mr. <laughs> Dawson, Scott Dawson did that. And then we had two beautiful horses, Rita and Bobby, <laughs> that came because the handlers are Robbie and Emma. These are not characters in Miss Wagner's book, but these are two horses that are the same breed as those in her book. And so these are called Clydesdales. Well, when they first wanted to have a horse that was really strong, that could carry a lot of weight, like on the back of a sled or on the back of a wagon, or they could pull a plow through the dirt in order to plant the seeds. I met Miss Wagner at the Kansas Library Conference and we started chatting and realized that we were both school librarians and the fact that she had books to share knowing that our kids don't have a lot of experience with Clydesdales or horses in general so we thought it'd be a really perfect match for them to come learn about the horses and learn about being an author as well. Many times they listen to them above their teachers <laughs> so it was really great that we were able to team with a local librarian, but also with a local farm because they kind of go hand in hand on that side. She'll sniff your hand. Hopefully she won't give you a nibble. Do you see all the hair in her ears? That's a lot of hair, isn't it? Anytime that we can do an enrichment program that either broadens their horizons or like Clydesdales are not a part of their curriculum, but have that experience to learn about them, to understand that there's research behind a book when it's written, same as the pictures that have to be researched and taken in order to make the illustrations for those books, but seeing that their world is much larger than just what we learned in math or what we learned in social studies or what we learned in science and kind of bringing it all together.